What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Kirbisha and welcome to my channel. As you guys can see, my room is actually very empty and that is because I'm moving into my new apartment. And I am going to have a video on that. That is going to be my move-in day vlog. So be on the lookout for that video. But today, I'm going to show you guys how to do your own glass album cover, okay? You guys can do this by yourself for very cheap you do not have to go spend $25 on these album covers when you could do it by yourself for three dollars and I'm gonna show you guys how to do that today so before we get into the video don't forget to subscribe down below give this video a big thumbs up and while you guys are down there just go ahead and turn those post notifications on so you get notified whenever I post another video so let's just go ahead and get into this glass album cover so these are all the items you're gonna need all you're gonna need is a photo frame so you could use the glass this was a dollar at Dollar Tree all you need is white paint and you can also get the um, sharpie the white sharpie that is very good but I just had white paint I could not find the white sharpie so I'm just using white paint today but the white sharpie would be your best option if you like feel like you don't really have like a steady hand and you can't really you won't be able to get the line straight it was very hard for me but you know this is the only thing I have so this is what I'm using and then you need the album picture I had this um, Kodak paper and that's what I printed the album picture on and then you can just print the you could pick anything you want I used Apple music but you could use Spotify and you could just print you just print this out I'll insert a clip of how I did that for you guys so what I did is I went into Apple music and I took a screenshot of the song I went into my photos and edited it i cropped it to where it was just a song name pop smoke the pause and play reverse and all of that and then i saved that sent it to my email and printed it out on my computer and you'll need paper scissors and windex so let's do this and you'll need a brush a very little brush i forgot to mention that you will do the same exact thing for the album picture. You can find it on your phone or find it on your computer and just print that out. You can either print it on regular paper or on the Kodak paper like I did. So as you guys can see, I'm just taking the glass out of the photo frame so I can go ahead and use it. You will not be needing that photo frame unless you want to protect the glass from breaking before you put it on your wall. So the first thing that I'm actually going to do is I'm going to clean the front of the glass and make sure it's nice and clean and doesn't have any handprints, or, I meant fingerprints, on where I'm going to be painting. Now you're just going to want to grab your sheet. You can tape it down so the glass doesn't move, but I'm not going to do that. I did not feel like getting up to go get tape. But if you do not want the glass to move at all, just go ahead and put tape on there. But you're going to line it up to where you would like it to be. Then you're going to get your paint or you're going to get your Sharpie, your white Sharpie. And you're going to start tracing the fast forward, pause, and reverse button and you're going to do the same for the song name the artist the what is it the loading bar and then the little three dots in the corner so what i like to do is paint it and wait until it dries before i move on to the top part so i don't smudge it Thank you. 
if there are any imperfections, all you have to do is get that paper towel, some water, and just clean it up and make sure all the lines are straight. So I'll be back when I'm done with the bottom part. So if you feel like you can still see the glass, you can go ahead and put on two coats of paint. But I think I'm only doing one because it looks kind of good, but we'll see. Now I'm just going to go ahead and do the top part. I'm a perfectionist and I know you guys are not going to want to sit here and just watch me do this for like 30 minutes to make sure everything is perfect. I do go through and clean everything up and make sure it's correct, but I am going to just go ahead and skip on to the next part. Now I'm just going to go ahead and trace the something special and the pop smoke, the E and the circle. I'm not going to do all of it in the video, but I will come back with everything done. Now this is how it's supposed to look once you're done tracing and everything. Looks very nice and neat. Now the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your photo album picture and you're going to cut it out, okay? Make sure you cut it out perfectly. I know you guys don't wanna see me cutting this paper out cause I'ma take a long time, but I'ma just go ahead and skip that and get to where the paper is all cut out. So once you got it all cut out, the first thing you wanna do is get your Windex and clean the back of the glass. Make sure it's all clean and your handprints are all gone. Now we're just going to take that album photo and place it on there. Make sure it's straight and exactly where you want it centered in the middle. Now you can use Mod Podge to put this on, but I don't have Mod Podge. But you can get that at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. So I'm just going to use tape. And what you're going to do is you're going to put the tape on the corners of the picture to where it's able to stick to the glass but you can't really see it if you guys are understanding what i'm saying so it's just going to be a little piece on the glass where it's able to stay on that glass but you're not able to actually see the tape if you get what i mean
right and that is how you make your glass album okay you see guys it was very easy and i told you guys the other things that you can use to make it easier you can use mod podge to stick the album picture on and you can use the white sharpie to just trace the other things so it's not as hard but this is how you do it it's only three dollars it's cheap and it looks really good so if you guys enjoyed the video go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below and join the fam and while you guys are down there just go ahead and turn that post notification on so you get notified whenever i post another video Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next video. Bye. Bye.